Okay, today let's watch me paint Rabbi Schneerson. I did this for my Chabad in Palm Coast, Florida. You guys know who you are. Love you guys. Okay, so I started the video already having had drawn uh, Rabbi Schneerson onto the canvas. So then I just went for it with that yellow background and um, went right in there with that hat. <laughs> I was excited to paint the hat um, and the coat. I really like the contrast here between the yellow and the black. C heavy contrast is my thing. I just, I love it. It's, it makes for a nice pop effect. So um, I didn't want to get too nitty gritty with the details. I just kind of wanted a more impressionistic style. It just, it felt, it feels like that fits um, for, for, for the subject matter for Rabbi Schneerson more of a fun kind of guy, warm, kind. I love this picture that I found of him and I'm using as my reference photo. He's standing outside of 770 Eastern Parkway here and he's, um, I think he's standing at a Bima and talking to a crowd of people. <laughs> that smile. Uh, the beard was fun to paint. It was fun to make it fluffy. The hands were not fun to paint. Hands are, um, the thing with hands is that every time you look back at the reference photo, I mean, for me, they, it just appears that they appear to have changed again, like where all the light is bouncing off each, you know, joint and knuckle. It always looks like it keeps changing, but I eventually, I, I got it. Um, the book was fun to paint. This whole, this whole painting was fun to paint and it only took me a couple of days, just about maybe like eight hours total a lot of that is just waiting for layers of paint to dry and this is the completed painting of rabbi schneerson interestingly his yard site is coming up on saturday I, I didn't even realize that when i decided to do this painting of him but nonetheless it was by shirt all right guys thanks for watching talk to you soon bye